Okay, I see y'all on there. All right. It was looking kind of crooked to me, so I was trying to fix it the best way I could. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Sex Talk with Sharonda. My name is Sharonda Parker, and I am your host. And it is Freaky Friday. I hope y'all ready. We got an interesting show today. So, one of my nieces, because y'all know in the group, I'm the auntie. Y'all the nieces. And the other ladies in the group is y'all cousins. One of my nieces, y'all cousins, wrote in and said she was talking to this guy, I guess messing with him, communicating, whatever, for four months. She said four whole months. And she got down there to suck his dick. And it looked like he had dry skin all over his dick. And when she was sucking on it, she felt like it was going to start removing itself in her mouth. And she asked him what it was. And he told her he had eczema on his dick. Let's unpack this. Let's unpack it, y'all, because I'm very aware of eczema. It's like a skin allergy, and I know it's seasonal, and some people have um, outbreaks that are a little more severe than others. I remember when my oldest daughter was a little girl, they kept telling me that she had a ringworm in her face, and they were really treating her for a ringworm, and then we ended up getting referred to the dermatologist the whole time it was eczema. So... We have had our issue with eczema in our household as well. But a lot of times when we think about um, skin allergies like eczema, sometimes we forget that the genitals are a part of the skin. Oh, but let me tell you about y'all, my nieces. Y'all is vicious, baby. Oh, y'all is vicious. Now, first of all, y'all was talking about you you sucked it and you only knew him for four months. Ah, stop right there. Because a lot of y'all bitches meet a man in the club and y'all suck dick after four hours. So if we gonna keep it 100 in this group, we is gonna keep it 100 in this group. It's a lot of y'all to have one night stands and y'all know when y'all get on that liquor, y'all bitches be nasty, nasty, nasty. And you be putting dicks in your mouth that you only done been a, acquainted with for four hours. Now, my niece says she waited four whole months to get this dick. She waited longer than Steve Harvey said you're supposed to wait. Because Steve Harvey said you're supposed to at least do 90 days. And my motherfucking niece waited four months. And y'all ain't gonna drag her like this here. After she done waited four months to get to the dick. Only to find out that he got a disorder. We're going to go a little further. I'm going to just show you how this girl. Let me tell you something. Women is something. Baby, women is vicious. Who you want to see some vicious shit? Put a group of women together. Some of y'all said cousin. It wasn't no eczema on his dick. This what had happened. He went over there and fucked Jane. And then he ain't wash his dick good. And then he came back and put Jane juices in your mouth. That was all the Jane juices all over his dick that you were sucking on. Y'all bitches ain't shit. Y'all say the man ain't clean his dick good. And it was cum from Jane all over his dick. It was not eczema. And I'm just like, Lord, have mercy. Somebody tag RL. Somebody tag the healthcare professionals. Somebody tag these people. Because I need to understand what is going on. Because people act like eczema can't be on the dick too up in here. This man can't even get the benefit of the doubt. Child is scared my niece. Y'all got her thinking she got venereal diseases all in her mouth. Y'all got my niece thinking she didn't ate up Jane Cum. It got to be everything but the eczema. It just can't be the eczema. Now, let me say this here. Now, I know he probably, he might not even knew he was about to get his dick sucked. He might not even knew that she was planning on giving him some pussy. Because, you know, sometimes when people don't feel like they're having sex right now, they start neglecting themselves. 
Y'all bitches know. Y'all know when y'all know y'all ain't. When you wouldn't put the pussy on strike, you stop going and get waxed. You just completely say, you know what? I ain't going to even worry about going to that wax appointment because I ain't fucking nobody right now. It don't need to be cleaned up, trimmed up. It don't need to be pretty for nobody because when it's pretty, I want to give it away. So in order to make me have self-control, I'm not going to go and get it waxed. Now, how we know? He might have been like, you know what? I ain't fucking about it right now. I ain't about to be putting all that cream all over my dick. I I, I ain't treating my dick right now because I ain't fucking. He didn't even know that he was. And then some people, and let me just say something about men. Men, they'll do the basics. Like, they'll put a little deodorant on and stuff like that. But we know them motherfuckers don't even like to put lotion on. I seen a picture of a man that is a stripper, entertainer. And his ass had on shorts. And it looked like, I don't know where he was. It looked like he was vacationing. I don't know. He might have been on the beach. He might have been in salt water. I don't know. But I just know when he took the picture, his knees was white. And that was the first thing I saw. And I say, now look, he know he entertained for a living. And I know he want to show everybody he in another country. But what he should have did was omitted this picture or either posted the top half of his body. Because this motherfucker knees is white. So I'm just letting y'all know that men... They do the fucking bare minimum, some of them. And a lot of them, they'll put some deodorant on, but they ain't going to take their time and baby all they self. And they ain't going to take their time and grease they self. So, you know, a lot of them, if they ain't itching in the creases, they ain't even grabbing the eczema cream to put it on. And that's the truth. But y'all said that this man couldn't have possibly had eczema. Y'all gave this man come all over his dick. Y'all said that the man had been contracted an STD. There was no way it could have been dry skin. There was no way it could have been eczema. And that niece was doing too much after four months. Now, I know y'all... I sucked Spencer dick in less than four months. So, I know bitches is sucking dick in less than four months. And I wasn't even sucking no dick like that. But I put that one in my mouth in less than four months. So, I, I, I'm just tripped out on y'all... Talking about, oh, you only know him for four months and you suck this dick. I, <laughs> I gotta look. <laughs> y'all know goddamn well. Y'all be ready to give a pussy in two days if you think he got a list of them going on for itself. You be ready to give up the pussy. And I know, I know bitches that'll suck a dick before they give pussy up. I know a bunch of bitches that will suck a nigga dick before she even before he even know what the pussy look like. He didn't got that mouth. <sighs> but y'all be acting brand new on this internet like I don't know y'all. And I know y'all bitches. I've been knowing a lot of y'all hoes a long time. A lot of y'all done came through. A lot of y'all done sucked strange dick in the motherfucking strip show going on. And the stripper pull out that big beautiful dick and you like, give it to me. Come on with it. I done seen this shit for my own. Ain't nobody done told me this. I done seen bitches do this my own self on their liquor. And a stripper pull out their dick and they put that bitch in their mouth. And I know they don't know this man because he's be fucking out of town strippers. And you don't know he done got his dick sucked in every city he done visited. Okay, but y'all want to act brand new on this uh, Facebook group. Y'all want to act brand new. And y'all want to make my little niece feel bad for waiting four months to put the dick in her mouth only for it to have scaly skin. And he start shedding like he a fucking snake. Poor baby. Poor baby. <laughs> Catch me on Clubhouse today, y'all, at 2 p.m. Central Standard Time. If you have not added... Ask Sharonda to your clubhouse regiment routine list. Add me. The first 30, I'm going to do from 2 o'clock to 3 o'clock. First 30 minutes, we are talking about small dick. We're doing small, stick, small dick stories. First 30 minutes, last 30 minutes. Ask me whatever you want. Meaning that you can raise your hand and you can ask Sharonda whatever you want. No question is off limits. And I'm going to be completely honest with you completely 100 so whatever you want to know about me whatever you want to know i'm gonna let you know everything other than how much money i make don't ask me how much money i make okay we can discuss everything but that we ain't discussing no finances all right so i'm gonna catch y'all at 2 p.m on the clubhouse 
like, share, and subscribe. If you enjoyed today's live, hit up the cash app and send a tip because I know y'all bitches got y'all tax money. I know them deposits is hitting right about now. Go ahead and bless your auntie. You all be blessed. You all be safe. I love you all. See you all at 2 p.m. Central Standard Time on Clubhouse.